have this butternut squash, this beautiful butternut squash. We have these onions, we have this ginger and this garlic, and we have all these beautiful spices. I figured might as well make a nice uh, butternut squash curry. Isn't it beautiful? It's butternut squash season. It's like a little baby, a little baby, a little baby. So I'm gonna treat it like one. I like to peel off the skin first. This is awesome. Make sure they're all cut up into the same size cubes so that they cook all the way through at the same time. I think the altitude is getting to me a little bit. I feel like I need to breathe more. So this pan is nice and hot. I'm gonna add some oil here. And I'm gonna do kind of a South Indian uh, preparation, South Indian style curry, which usually starts off with some mustard seeds. So I've got about a tablespoon here. That goes in. Uh, about the equal quantity of cumin seeds. Yeah. And to this, I'm gonna add just a pinch of hang. You don't have to add hang, it's kind of got an intense garlic onion flavor. So if you're gonna add it, add it just add a pinch to this oil. Cashews. And these cashews are very cones burning, so you have to keep an eye on them. This is smelling good. Now this is also optional. I like to add just a few whole spices, some black peppercorns, some cloves, just so every so often you get something a little bit different, you know? I'm gonna take my chances and let them cook just a little bit longer. Actually, no, that looks good. Two onions, finely diced. Saute these onions in this beautifully seasoned oil. These onions, I'm gonna add a pinch of turmeric just to get some nice color on them. And instantly, these onions turn into a beautiful, nice golden color. Mmm, it smells heavenly. Add some salt. Salt's gonna draw some moisture out of the onions, gonna concentrate the sugars, allowing them to cook a little bit faster. <laughs> to these onions, I'm going to add some ginger garlic paste. And you just kind of want to saute this a bit until the raw flavors from the ginger and the garlic start to cook out. And you can smell when that happens. Oh, dude. And to this, I'm going to add about a tablespoon of ground coriander. That should be good, maybe a little more. I'm going to add some red chili powder. I'm going to add about two tablespoons. That should be good. This one is good. Yes. And to this, add Nice cubed butternut squash. Oh. Oh. So hungry. Dude, you're gonna get a feast out of this. I'm just gonna add a little bit of water. Put a cover on. And we're just gonna let this cook for a while, maybe 10 or 15 minutes, until each squash cube is nice, fork tender. What's up, everybody? What's up? Let's take a peek. Very nice. So, this dish is almost done and it smells delicious. I'm so excited to eat it. It's gonna be beautiful. But it needs one last thing. Cilantro. <laughs> It's, you know, driving me to drink, and it's becoming a real issue these days. You know, thanks a lot.